Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. So today, as you can tell by the title of the video, I'm getting a puppy and I'm really, really excited about it. Um, for anyone who's been a part of my channel for a while, you guys are probably like, didn't you just get bunnies like a couple months ago? Yes, we did. And they are not working out. So my one of my friends is actually going to take them. So I'll still be able to see them and all of that. But they are chewing my trim on my brand new house. They don't let me sleep because they want to try and get under our bed that we have gated off. They eat everything. And I just can't do it anymore. I can't. Um, so I thought that a puppy would be a good idea. <laughs> this was very like not planned at all. Um, my cousin actually rescued like six puppies from an abandoned house and she lives like three hours away from me. And um, I was like, stop it. Like, are you selling those? And she was like, I'm just finding them good homes. And I was like, so free because I want one. <laughs> um, and she was like, yeah, which one do you want? So I told her which one I wanted. So we're going to pick the puppy up tomorrow. Um, but today we have to go get all of the puppy supplies, obviously. So I'm bringing you guys along for that. I'm super, super excited. Um, I wrote a list of things that we need for the puppy and it's way less things than what I needed for a rabbit. So that's good. But yeah, so we're going to go get all of the puppy stuff today and then I'll take you guys along tomorrow to pick up the puppy itself. Um, it's a girl and I think I'll insert a picture right here, but I'm pretty sure that she is an Aussie and Rottweiler mix and possibly some Pitbull in there too. Um, the Aussie is from her fur coat. It's like 100% Australian Shepherd. Um, but then like the little eyebrows that she has is definitely like Rottweiler, but then her siblings, like one of her siblings has less of the Aussie and more of like the Pitbull in him. So I'm pretty sure that we've got a whole bunch of mixes in there, but she is the cutest little thing and supposedly she's really fluffy and she's really sweet and I'm super, super excited. Um, and apparently, according to my cousin, I got her at the perfect timing because right after I claimed her, she has like five plus, uh, yesterday it was five people, she says she has more now, that have been wanting to get that one. And she was like, so, like you got her in the perfect time and I was like, yes. So, but yeah, so we're gonna go, we're gonna go to Marshall's first and see what kind of pet supplies we can find there. Um, and then whatever we don't find at Marshall's, we're going to go to some pet store. I'm not really sure which one, but let's go ahead and go get some puppy stuff. Okay, hello you guys. I'm back from Marshall's and then we also went in like a pet store for like a couple minutes to get one thing. Um, but I didn't film that part. Um, but we have a lot of stuff. Um, the only thing I didn't get is dog food because I really want to do some research and make sure I'm getting like the right dog food and not just like the cheapest dog food or the name brand dog food or whatever it is. I'm kind of hesitating so I'm going to do some research today and then we'll pick some up tomorrow when we go get her so first thing i'm going to show you since it's over here is this cute little dog bed it's like this really pretty like earthy green which is kind of the theme of our whole house with some little paw prints on it and honestly from distance it kind of looks like daisies and i'm in love with it so we got that and then the thing we got from the pet stores so we had to get her a leash so we just got like a little pink one and then we got her this collar that has strawberries on it it's so cute i'm so excited Jonathan doesn't think it's gonna look good on her, but we'll see. I'm gonna keep the receipt in case it doesn't look good and then we can always return it. She didn't give me a receipt. Good thing I have an account. Next is the food and water bowls that we got. I love them, but they look like this. They have like a little stand with like the white bowl in it and they have like fish bones on them, which kind of makes me think that they're cat bowls, but it says for pets and this is definitely paw prints yeah but i think this is so cute so we got two of these one for water one for food then we got this giant thing to put the food in it came with a scooper um and then i have two bags of stuff in here because it was just easier to transport it that way um okay in this bag we have some nail clippers 
We have some tennis balls that squeak. I got this mat to put underneath the bowls. It's a paw print, but it's like a earthy tone. Love that. And then we got this um, dental bone. Uh, that was Johnson's request. And then we got a little jar to put the treats in. Looks like this has little dogs all over it. It's so cute. I'm in love with this. So, got that. Okay, I think that's everything in that bag. We got a brush. It's like a double-sided brush. I don't know exactly. Um, and then we got this little elephant stuffed animal thing for her to chew on. I love elephants and I want her to like elephants too, so got this then we got these little teething rings for puppies um it helps them have healthy teeth and bones and it helps their brain development so got that then we got some burt's bees shampoo for the little pup and then we also got these little crunchy biscuits for treats to put in the treat jar so that's all the stuff we got I'm super, super excited. I'm probably not gonna set anything up quite yet um, because I'm in the middle of filming another vlog. So I need to do some stuff for that vlog. Um, but I will show you guys when I set everything up. So that's all for now. camera is having some serious issues right now um but i wanted to update you guys on the puppy so we did get the puppy um and she's amazing her name is charlie um and she is super super sweet we are working on bite inhibition right now because we think she was taken from the litter a little bit too early so she does want to bite a lot um but this is charlie oh, charlie 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 trying to show them you so this is little charlie see she just she's kind of crazy um but we love her see that's the biting yes she's doing okay with potty training sometimes she will pee or poop out of spite but other than that she's doing pretty good um i wanted to show you guys um her stuff set up because i never did that so but we have her leash hanging right here this is like a little handkerchief bandana kind of thing but it got really dirty so i need to wash it but it's just hanging up there She's got her leash, and then this is her tub of food. Ow. Um, we are with Blue Buffalo for now. Sorry, she's biting me. So we're with Blue Buffalo for now. Um, they just don't have a lot of the preservatives and stuff, or like the corn or anything like that in their food. It's pretty clean. So that's what we're going with for now. She also does do some of the wet food, too. Um, and then this is her little food and water station with her bowls and her mat. Yes, and then we have her treats and stuff up here. So in this tree is her little training treat. So they're mini and they're made for like training sessions. Um, and then this is her oat and banana treats that she gets only when she's going in her crate. So she knows when she's getting one of those, it's time to go in her crate, um, which she does go in willingly. Charlie, come on. Um, she does like to go in her crate. Um, it provides a lot of comfort for her. This is the crate setup that we have. Her bed actually fits perfectly in here. And then we just have a couple of toys in there for her to chew on. And then we do cover it with a blanket whenever she's in it. This just helps her anxiety a lot more. Um, she um, likes to have the blanket down. Um, it just helps her not be like distracted. And she really enjoys it. As you can see, she's not nervous or scared to go in there. She really does like to sleep in there. That's pretty much all of her stuff. That's the other thing too. If you tell her no, she barks back at you. It's kind of like back talk. So we're working on her attitude as well. Um, but yes, yeah, so that's our sweet little pup. Um, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and 